Special movie. Oh, baby with the bitties right off the bat. Thank you. You are amazing. But, <clears throat> we are going to be playing one of my favorite games ever. And, uh, yeah, because it's my birthday and I want to, damn it. <laughs> so, this is actually the first time I am going to be playing this on the PlayStation 4. So, yay. So, there's so much, there's a lot of different things that we could do since it was, you know, remastered. It's more or less the PC port. But, uh, yeah. We're gonna go ahead and, uh, play our game. <coughs> and see how we do. But I'm super excited to be playing this. I've been wanting to play Final Fantasy VII for a while, again. And Square Enix's E3 got me super hyped to do so. So here we are, back in my favorite game of all time. I don't care what you say, Tim. Square Enix still won E3 because it had the best showing going. Not Nintendo. I said it. I don't give a fuck if Nintendo had Pokemon or it had, uh, what is it? Breath of the Wild 2. It's pretty much all it really had. It had some Animal Crossing Switch, but... Yeah, whatever. God damn it. I got lemonade on my glasses. So, Libby. Um. I know you don't know, like, diddly squat about Final Fantasy VII. So, I'm happy you get to, uh be here and find out all about the best game ever. It really is. It really is. But yeah, I'm gonna have to make some kind of border thingy or something. Because I'm not entirely sure if I can make it widescreen or not. Those black bars bothered me. <laughs> I could fix it now, but I'm not going to. Damn it, I wanna play. Boom. Dude, it's so freaking cool being back in this game. Oh, I haven't played it in about a year or two. Normally play it like once every year, but come on, newcomer, follow me. I'm not really gonna do their voices because we all know what their voices sound like. If you don't, Watch the new trailer. Really glad I have a mouth now. Give me your potion. Now I get to kill these guys. Uh, <laughs> oh, that turn face goodness. These guys are pretty fucking easy. All I gotta do is hold down X for them. But it gets a lot harder along the way. So, baby, we get to raise chocobos later on in this. And we get to raise them, too. I know you'd probably get a kick out of that. I can't... Okay, I can use the D-pad, because it feels weird using an analog stick to play this. Let's do this right quick. Uh... Let's go into the config. I need my window fixed. I'm sorry, I can't do the blue. Could not do the blue. 
I know that might be your favorite color, boo, but I can't do it. We got to go green. Screw that blue, too. There we go. That's what's pretty. Okay, let's go. Wow, you used to be in Soldier, huh? And not every day you find one in a group like Avalanche. Soldier, aren't they the enemy? What's he doing with an, with us in Avalanche? He was in Soldier, Jesse. But he quit and is with us now. I didn't catch your name. It's motherfucking Cloud, people. We don't change their names, by the way. I, they they have to be their name. There's one character whose name is going to be changed. And that is later on because, yeah. Cloud, huh? I'm... I don't care what your names are. Once this job's over, I'm out of here. Oh yeah, by the way, Cloud was a dick at the beginning of the game, so... The hell you all doing? I thought I told you never to move in a group. Our target's the North Mako Reactor. We'll meet on the bridge in front of it. Yeah, we will. That's where we're gonna be taking on their guard scorpion after we put on the bomb. Ex-soldier, huh? I don't trust you. That is big old Barrett, Mr. T, wanna be. Press the directional buttons while pre uh, press the directional buttons while pressing circle to run. I know that, damn it. Playing since the first PlayStation. I know there ain't nothing around. Oh, it's. I know. I know. I just said I didn't want to use the direction. Um, the D stick. But it's kind of natural holding this controller and going for it. it it's weird. Hitting me with your tentacle. Oh, I fucking love this game. Hopefully, Chad's not broken. How's the game look and sound, babe? Hopefully, you could hear it and me just fine. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> oh, hi, Libby. Does everything sound alright? Look alright? I wanna see something. I could go to that one. But it looks too stretched out. Let me look through the settings to see if there's. Eh, there's nothing. No, there's nothing I can really do about the black bars. I'm gonna have to make like a border or something. But that that's for a later date. Yo, is this your first time in a reactor? No, after all, I did work for Shinra, you know. The planet's full of Mako energy. People here use it every day. Thank you, Boo. It's the lifeblood of this planet, but Shinra keeps sucking the blood out of it. Out with these uh, weird machines. I'm not here for a lecture. Uh, let's just do it. Alright, you come with me from now on. Ah, we got Barrett! Barrett's on our team. Code deciphered. So who who else are you lurking, boo? And uh, what are you up to? Code deciphered. Phoenix down. Yeah, I know, I pushed that button. I'm done with it. Now here comes Barrett the talk. Little by little, the reactors will drain out of all the life, and then that'll be it. 
It's not my problem. The planet's dying, Cloud. The only thing I care about is finishing this job before security and the robo guards come. Oh, Barrett pissed. Barrett pissed! Bam. 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 Woohoo! Oh god. The Rebel Guards! No! <laughs> I do have the lightning. Oh, it's gonna shoot the shit out the Barret! Bam, bam. Oh, this game brings back a lot of memories. I remember getting this game and not really knowing how I was going to like it when it first released. And uh, I actually have to thank my cousin Polly for introducing it to me. Because he was the first one I seen playing it back on um, around the time it released. And I watched him play it for a little bit. And then uh, I, I had to own it because he, uh, he actually rented it. He had to return it. So I didn't get to see the ending. So uh, I, I actually begged my dad to uh, go ahead and get it for me. Which he ended up doing shortly, you know, a few days later. And I've been playing it ever since. The, uh, the, the game is amazing. And I can't, I can't say that enough. This, this is one of the best games ever made, in my opinion. Lurking Crazy, Decahoon, and Groovy. Watching you and playing Overwatch. Overwatch. Overwatch is fun. And I forgot to turn the sound off of my phone because... If I don't, my brother's gonna end up calling me like he normally does. Like, always. So I'm gonna take a couple of hits here. And lower my phone. Well, we wanna get lured to these bastards real quick. Dex, not the coon. Okay. Is uh, crazy still playing Borderlands? Oh, we're coming up to the first boss battle. And save, please. Oh, not everything's unlocked. I forgot. Well, save one, please. That that was a weird save screen. I'm still not used to it. I'm still just used to seeing like the original PlayStation shit. <coughs> ah. <coughs> coffin, coffin, coffin. Yes, he is. That's cool. Oh, got that restore materia. Oh, I don't think I could eat. Wait, hold on. Am I doing something wrong here? I think I am. I don't think I could equip it right now. Okay. Oh, what's up, Rose? Poor Mary. Cloud, you sent the bomb. Shouldn't you do it? He's got one fucking arm, man. Just do it. I gotta watch to make sure you don't pull nothing. Fine, I'll do it. Oh, God. Watch out. This isn't just a reactor. 
I can't wait to play the remake. All that stuff is going to be explained a hell of a lot more. What's wrong? Huh? Oh, what's wrong, Cloud? Hurry it up. Yeah, sorry. Hey, man. Happy birthday. Thank you, Shion. We're playing the best game ever. My birthday was actually yesterday, but I didn't stream yesterday, so I'm taking full advantage of it today. Heads up, here it comes. Oh, the guard scorpion. One of the one of the best freaking and easiest enemies going. First boss of the game. So what are you up to, Shion? How you been? Did they actually showed uh, the Guard Scorpion boss battle from the remake off yesterday? And it it's night and day compared to this. It it's almost incredible. But I, I I honestly can't wait to March when the the remake uh, part one I would guess would be coming out. Huh. <sighs> Oh, the remake does look amazing, and they finally showed off Tifa, which was awesome. I don't need any of that yet. Oh, shit. Defend. <laughs> Barret, be careful. Attack while its tail's up. It's gonna it's counter attack with its laser. You don't want that shit. Cloud's about to feel it. Oh shit. I didn't mean to die. I even put it in before the tail went up. That's alright, we can take the time to heal up a little bit. And uh and do our thing. What are you at, Cloud? There we go. Is there, uh, is there anything else coming out for The Sims 4 that was shown off at E3? Any new expansions or whatnot? Search scope now. Locked on target. Screw your login gun. Just die, please. It should be almost over. Bow, bow. What's up, Mike? There we go. Finish his ass off. Oh, God. Oh, we got the assault gun for Barrett. We have another weapon for him. Come on, let's get out of here. Ten minutes to detonation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. We're going to put this on because it'll make Barrett a little bit stronger. Thank you. Time to get the frick out of here. Now we get to escape and watch it go kaboom. This will be a lot of fun. You know, every three steps we're going to be getting into a battle though, so... No back attacks for you, you bastards. It wasn't at E3, I think, but there's a new expansion coming called Island Living, or something like that. It looks really nice. I, I gotta check it out. How many expansions are there for uh, The Sims right now? Oh god, no. By the way, this is a very grindy, old-school RPG. 
if you haven't realized that yet. It, uh, it's gonna take a little bit of time to go through it. Especially since we're not, um, using, like, the cheap bullshit. Now D. Cahoon is streaming. Oh, was she streaming, um, Destiny 2 again? <laughs> There's so many. So many DLCs for it. Jesus, Shan. You have them all, don't you? Oh, someone just followed! You are awesome! Thank you, man! <laughs> Thank you for the follow as well! But we're playing the best game ever! I mean... I mean... It, to me it is. Anyway. <laughs> I wanted to play this for a while, but uh... I haven't gotten around to it, but after seeing uh, E3 and them showing off the remake, I want to play this before that comes out. So here we are! Objection! Final Fantasy VII. But how is everybody in chat doing tonight? Hopefully you guys are all amazing. Kick his ass, Barrett. Cloud with the lightning bolt. I prefer 8 and 9 to be honest, but 7, 8, 9 are all damn classics. Damn right! Um, did you see the announcement uh, yesterday that they're finally remastering 8 for the PS4, Xbox One, and so on and so forth? Uh, Square Enix released that at their E3 presser yesterday. I, um, that actually gives me a, a reason to play 8 again. Eight, I I got pissed off with that announcement. Why? Did you think they were they were gonna be remaking it or? I thought for a split second it was going to be another remake. Who knows if if um seven goes well, which I mean honestly we all know seven was like Square Enix's emergency button. But, uh, if that goes well, I could see them... I could see them remaking 8 and then 9. I would love it if they remade 8 and 9. I wanna... I wanna like 8. Okay? Don't get me wrong. I, I do have a little love for 8. I've played it multiple times. But... Like, halfway through, the story just got completely ridiculous. And I would love them to remake it. To fix that. Like, not everybody on your team should have uh, should have been from the same orphanage and how Ada was your like dead mother or whatever and the Sid from the school was her wife and it just got really ridiculous. Oh, thir 15... I have mixed feelings with 15. I liked 15, but uh, it it was really weird. Okay, now everyone get back. 15 was a weird one. I enjoyed it because I've been waiting for it for like ever. But a lot of that story was so choppy and it, they had to go through multiple DLCs to try to fix it up. They had to redo, I think, Chapter 7 or something. Because of all the... Yeah! Yeah, it was, um... The one chapter where I think you were using Noctis alone. They had to redo because it was completely... It was complete trash. It was complete trash. Hey. If it's about your money, wait till we get back. Yeah, there was, there was a lot of backlash with 15. But, uh... I mean, I'm, I'm done with 15. I got the platinum for that. 
you were on the train going through the icy tunnel area. And yeah, that was near the uh, the ending. Excuse me. Yo, I don't know. I'm I'm pretty sure anybody who came here to see this game has seen the trailer. They showed off this part in the remake trailer. What the hell was going on with Aerith, and what do you all think the phantoms were that were floating around her and Cloud after she grabbed his hand, asking for help? <clears throat> I honestly have a theory that what she's seeing there, that's, you know, floating around her, is like the Ancients. M magic Turk people? <laughs> oh, these? Do you like them? They're only one kill. <laughs> ah, sure, I'll buy one. <laughs> but I, I honestly think that's the, the Ancients or whatever, because she's supposed to be the, like the last one with the blood of the Ancients. So... <laughs> Invisible Turk ninjas? <laughs> Could be! Could be! I mean, I wouldn't doubt it. I wouldn't be surprised if it was. That's how Reno's been watching her. <laughs> Why are you just standing there? I wonder what that is on the wall over there. Let's see, don't be fooled by shit. Mako energy doesn't last forever. Mako is the planet's life source. Yeah, okay. Let's -a go. Burr, burr, burr. Hey, you there. Nah, we're not fighting. Go away. Oh, I guess we're fighting them because I hit the button way too goddamn quick. Bow, 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 bow. Not like these guys are going to be any kind of uh, issue. All I gotta do is hold down X here. And we could go faster, look at that. Well, here, here's a question for you guys. Um, with Square Enix's track record, do you think that March 3rd um, release date for the remake is going to stick? Uh, I honestly hope it does, but, uh, I mean, we had to wait, like, ten years for fifteen, <laughs> and it's already been over five. Not a chance in Midgar. <laughs> Cloud never came. Cloud, you think he was killed? No way. Cloud? Why is she so sad? <laughs> 3 3 33 more like it. Yeah, I hope not. I, I'm trying to play the game before I, you know, I go senile. <laughs> How the hell would I know? Do I look like a mind reader? Huh. If y'all weren't such screw-ups. Hey, Barrett, what about our money? Nope. Uh, nothing, sorry. Yeah, I, I, I'm expecting it to be delayed another month or so. Around the time it's supposed to be released. Just like they did with 15. But you know what? I'd rather them take their time with the 7 remake than anything else. So if you gotta delay the damn game, do it. I'm not even gonna be mad at you. Just do it right. Looks like I'm a little late. You damn right you're late. Come waltzing in here and making a big scene. Gives me an extra month to save up for that stupid expensive collector's edition. How much is that thing? Did uh did they ever put a price on it? And before you tell me, if you know, I'm gonna say it's probably around like 250. It's no big scene, just what I always do. 
No price as far as I'm aware now. I honestly think it's going to be around 200 to the 250 mark. It's almost like buying a PlayStation 4. I, I feel it in my nuggets, I'm telling you. Having everyone worried like that, you don't give a damn about no one but yourself. Yeah, I'm betting about 150 euros for me, yeah. It's, it's gonna be crazy expensive, we all know it. Honestly, if I had the money for it, I would be throwing it at it, though. It, it's just that ty it's just that game for me. It's coming out of your share, hot shot. Wake up. We're moving out. Follow me. Hey, Cloud, you were great back there. Uh, uh, Cloud, we'll do even better next time. Careful, I'll shut this. Yo! Oh, Cloud, your face is pitch black. Um, what I'm really excited for is we're actually going to get more character interaction and character, um, build up on Jesse, Pigs, and Wedge. Which is probably going to make, um, their deaths a lot more meaningful. Which is probably going to be really sad. Say thanks for helping me back uh, there at the reactor. Also, Aerith. I, I don't know if I can handle that again. <laughs> Especially in freaking, like, 4K. It's gonna be bullshit. Bruh. No, everybody act nonchalant. <laughs> this poor fuck. This is why I hate the last train. <laughs> oh, boy. Watch them come out with a super special edition that has a PS4 Pro with the logo on it. With the game like they did for Kingdom... Oh, they're definitely going to. You damn well know it. Like, this is honestly Square and Sony's emergency button game. Square put this out probably because they were low on funds and knew that if they announced 7 Remake, people would be throwing money at their screens. <laughs> and yeah, I'm still with uh, the monkey there. I'm, I'll still buy it. <laughs> Stop acting like a damn kid. Sit down and shut up. Jesus Christ, man. This train hasn't switched to security mode yet. I'm sure that will change by tomorrow. Someday Avalanche is gonna be famous, and me too! You say so, buddy. Hey Cloud, you wanna look at this with me? It's a map of the Midgar rail system. Let's look at it together and I'll explain it to you. No even cosplay the cross-dressing scene if I have to get a hold of one. Yeah, I'm, I'm there with you. I'm there with you. I like this kind of stuff. Bombs and monitors, you know, flashy stuff. It's so flashy. Oh man, if, if somebody was gonna give me one of them and all I had to do was cross-dress like Cloud... Yeah! Yeah, I would. I don't care. Say what you want. You know what? I got a nifty special edition with a pro. Not like I don't like my PS4 Pro now, but... This part's boring, hurry up! Can I fast time this? No, I can't. <laughs> I don't want to look at the train route! God damn it! Whisper, whisper. We definitely look suspicious, so we're using fake IDs. No shit. Ah, speak of the devil. That light means that we're in the ID security check area. 
Whisper, whisper. When the lights go off, you never know what kind of creeps will come out. We're almost back now. What a relief! We're almost back to the Sector 7 slums. And tell us about that damn pizza. Look, you can see the surface now. This city don't have no day or night. If that plate were there, we could see the sky. A floating city. Pretty unsettling scenery. Huh? Never expected to hear that out of you, someone like you. You just full of surprises. The upper world, the city on a plate. It's cause of that damn pizza that people underneath are suffering. And the city below is full of polluted air. On top of that, the reactor keep draining up all the energy. Then why doesn't everyone move onto the plate? Dunno, probably cause they ain't got no money or maybe. Because they love their land no matter how polluted it gets. I know no one lives in the slums because they want to. It's like this train. You can't run a anywhere except where its rails take it. That's pretty fucking true. That's pretty true. I thought this scene was cool as hell. And then they showed Midgar off yesterday, and now it makes me sad. <laughs> and everybody goes super fast. Boom, boom. Yo, get over here, y'all. Yeah. This mission was a success, but don't get lazy now. The hard part's still to come. Don't y'all be scared of that explosion. Because the next one's gonna be bigger than that. Oh, why? Meet back at the hideout. Move out. Why's the next one gotta be bigger? If this one did the job, why's the next one bigger? Seriously. I'ma take the moment to save. Why? Because who the hell knows if my power will go out or not. <laughs> and I kind of don't want to do all that again. And this guy looks like he's just pissing on the fence. Why you gotta do that? Why you gotta be nasty? Hey, now, oops. What on earth are you doing? Just put out. Jeez. Huh? You came to see it too? There was a bombing on top of this pillar. It should come down. Everyone in the slums is dust. Well, there's no point in worrying about that. Hey, check it out. It's huge, ain't it? It's not like he was talking about his wang. Uh, we'll be running up that later. For damn sure. Brum, brum. Libby! How you doing in Overwatch there? And hopefully you're kicking ass. Hey, this is a strange and wonderful place. This is my place, but you can come here when you want to. See you, bro. Fuck weird. I know you were pissing on a fence. Yo, Cloud, over here now. I was talking to the strange dude, man. Uh, look. Why would you just go shoot and scare everyone out of the bar? Put holes in fucking shit. At least that's what it sounded like. Uh huh. You wanna meet your baby? What? Little baby? Hey, don't act like you don't know what I mean. I'm telling you. C can I? Can. Yeah, thanks. You're finally getting the hell out of the way. 
Best convo ever with D. Cahoon about the cat coffee bean and drinking with your butt. Explain that! Because what? Papa! <coughs> Arlene, aren't you going to say anything to Cloud? Welcome home, Cloud. Looks like everything went well. Did you fight with Barrett? Yeah, I should have known. He's always pushing people around, and you've always been in fights ever since you were little. I was worried. Tifa! Baby, this is who you're named after in our little gamer group thing. Flowers, how nice. You almost never see them here in the slums. But a flower for me? Oh, Cloud, you shouldn't have. Of course, we're giving it to Tifa. Screw the little girl. She's not ours. Thank you, Cloud. It smells wonderful. Maybe I should fill the store with flowers. Maybe you should. Sorry, Cloud. Marlene seems a little shy. <laughs> LOL. Okay, okay. So someone was talking about drinking and getting drunk. I stated you can get drunk through your butt in 1.5 seconds. Um. What? Why? I mean, I, I, under, I, I understand uh, what you're talking about, but Jesus. They then brought up about the cat poop coffee that is expensive. I don't know why it's expensive, okay? I know it's kind of like a special thing, but uh, no. I'm not going to drink uh, coffee made out of cat shit. That is fucking weird. Uh, no. Get in here, fools, we're starting to beat. Uh, yeah, she on. I know, I get it. What do you want, um. Are you playing with, uh, Decahoon, baby? Sit down. How about something to drink? Give me something hard. Just a minute, I'll make one for you. You know, I'm relieved you made it back safely. What's with you all of a sudden? That job wasn't even tough. I guess not. You were in Soldier. No, I'm watching you talking to... Uh... Pico? And lurking everyone. Alright, I'm gonna bounce, dude. Have a good birthday, man. Hope to catch you another stream soon. I've hit you up uh, on Twitter too. All right, man. Thank you so much. Thanks for stopping by, boss. Make sure you get your pay from Barrett. I'll I'll be streaming a uh, Beat Saber tomorrow night. If you want to stop it over there, we're gonna be playing the new track pack that just came out. Who's Pico, baby? <laughs> Make sure you get your pay from Barrett. Don't worry, once I get that, I'm out of here. Cloud, stop being a dick. Cloud, are you feeling alright? Yeah, why? No reason, you just look a little tired, I guess. Oh, she, she realized Cloud's fucked up in the head. Thanks, Chief. Have a good night. Yo, Cloud, there's something I want to ask you. Was there anyone from Soldier fighting us today? None, I'm positive. You sound pretty sure. If there was anyone from Soldier, you wouldn't be standing here now. Don't go thinking you so bad just cause you was in Soldier.
Oh god! <laughs> yeah, you're strong. Probably all them guys in Soldier are. But don't forget that your skinny ass working for Avalanche now. Don't get no ideas about hanging on to Shinra. Staying with Shinra? You asked me a question and I answered it, that's all. I'm going upstairs and want to talk about my money. Ah, damn it. Wait, Cloud. Tifa, let him go. Looks like he still misses the Shinra. Shut up. I don't care about neither Shinra or Soldier. But don't get me wrong. I don't care about Avalanche or the planet for that matter. Cloud being a hard ass. And here comes Tifa. And the police. Listen, Cloud, I'm asking you, please join us. Sorry, Tifa. The planet is dying slowly but surely. It's dying. Someone has to do something. So let Barrett and his buddies do something about it. It's got nothing to do with me. So, you're really leaving? You're just going to walk out, right? Walk out ignoring your childhood friend? What? How can you say that? You forgot the promise, too. Promise? So you did forget. Remember, Cloud, it was seven years ago. Oh, we're already at the promise. Look, the well. Do you remember? Yeah, back then. I thought you would never come, and I was getting a little cold. This little cloud! Look at how so cute he is. Sorry, I'm late. So polygonal. You said you wanted to talk about something. Come this spring, I'm leaving town for Midgar. All the boys are leaving town. But I'm different from them. I'm not just going to find a job. Hey, you got a pouty tail. I want to join Soldier. I'm going to be the best there is, just like Sephiroth. Sephiroth. The great Sephiroth. Oh, yeah, you're not going to like him much longer, Tifa. Isn't it hard to join Soldier? I probably won't be able to come back to this town for a while. Huh? If you make it, will you be in the newspapers? I'll try. Hey, let's make a promise. Um, if you get really famous and I'm ever in a bind, you'll come save me, alright? What? If I'm ever in trouble, my hero will come and rescue me. I want to experience that at least once. What? Come on, promise me. Alright, I promise. You remember now, don't you? Our promise? I'm not a hero, and I'm not famous, so I can't keep our promise. 
But you got your childhood dream, didn't you? You joined Soldier. So come on, you've got to keep your promise. Oh, fucker just came climbing up the pipes. Wait a sec, big time soldier. A promise is a promise here. Receives Barrett stash, 1500 gil. This is my pay? Don't make me laugh. What? Then you'll... You got the next mission lined up. I'll do it for 3,000. What? It's okay, it's okay. Psst, we're really hurting for help, right? Uh, the money's for Marlene's school. 2,000. Thanks, Cloud. We joined Avalanche. Not for long, because Avalanche ain't gonna be a thing, so what? Now a little bit. Good morning, Cloud. Did you sleep well? Next to you, who wouldn't? I don't know what you mean. <coughs> I'm going this time. Sweet! Our target's the Sector 5 reactor. I head for the station first. I'll fill you in on a train. Yo, Cloud. Before the next mission, I got something I want to ask you. Uh, I don't really know how to use material. I'll give you that material we found. Just teach me how to use it. Uh, he wouldn't understand. So this is what makes them soldier guys great, huh? Okay, I'll ask Jesse again later, but you're in charge of the materia. Thank you! Cloud, I got a message from the weapon shop man upstairs. He has something he wants to give you, don't forget. Marlene, you watch the store while we're gone. She, she just put like a five-year-old in charge of a bar. Alright, good luck! That is bad parenting 101. She's not even a parent. Let's see. Yeah, okay, whatever. Why am I from the- Thank you. We're gonna put the restore in her. And we're going to take- I like him with the lightning, but we're gonna take the ice out of him. Put it in him. If anything, we might be able to find more materia in the shops. So. I think I have to go up by this way. God damn, with the game. Hey, hey, what are it? You can't just walk out of here without buying something. Might be unhealthy for you. Yeah, that's cool. I mean, I already got that. Three of those will do us some good. Alright. God damn it. I am fumbling with all of this. It is not nice. Thank you. We don't have any other materia. Uh, oh, oh, kid. Shut up, car. Wait, wait. Okay. Ah, oh, fine. Let's see the ether. Yes. I know how to use all that. Oh, I'm not going through that. It's so uh, it's only the tutorial about the save and whatnot. Okay, come on, come on. You can do it, but thank you. This is a slum, so don't think you can stay for free. 
What are you going to do? Unk just doesn't just seeing the bed make you slip that way. Tough guy, huh? You better sleep when you can. You better save when you can. That's the trick of being tough. Remember that, old dude. Asshole. I know there was something somewhere. In one of these houses, we could steal like... 10, uh, gill from a child. Which sounds horrible, but it's worth it, I think. Actually, if we save it, uh... It'll be all good. Oh, another slow day. If this keeps up, the store's gone under. Can't sell any really good medicine in a slum like this. LOL. Why the LOL, baby? Oh, look at this. This doesn't happen every day. Are you a customer? Yes, welcome. We sell and buy. Oh, we can get... Okay. I'm gonna buy another fire. Another... Okay. Another restore. Because I do like having two healers on, uh... On my team. And I like Cloud being... No, 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 no. We give you ice. We'll also give you the restore materia, but we're gonna give Tifa. Oh, damn. Okay. We can't link that with her right now, so we're going to have to link it with him. There we go. And uh, we're set to go. Let's go meet up with these fools and be on our merry way. To blow up another reactor. Woohoo! Oh, welcome, lurkers. How are all you doing today? Hopefully, mighty fine. Oh, why? Every once in a while, it would like stutter. Yo, this ain't no private car, so split up. Hoodlums again. God, don't I just have all the luck? Here goes Barrett being tough. You say something? I said you say something? Now look at that. It got empty all of a sudden. What's going on? Damn. It, it's empty because of guys like you. Leave me with another 33 bitties. Thank you, Boo Boo. Yipes. You... You've seen the news, right? Avalanche says there will be more bombings. Only devoted employees like me would go to Midgar on a day like today. You work for Shinra? I won't give you the vi- Barrett! Uh, okay. Baby, you gave 50 biddies up today. Thank you so much, honey. So what are we gonna do now? The hell, the hell you so calm? You busted up my rhythm. Ah, away we go. Off to the next three after to make it go kaboom. Looks like they just finished connecting the cars. We're finally leaving. So what's our next target? Haha, <laughs> listen to Mr. Sirius about his word. Alright, I'll tell you. Jesse's probably already told you, but there's a security checkpoint at the top plate. It's an ID scan system checking all their trains. Which Shinra is very proud of. We can't use our fake IDs anymore. That means we've got to only... We've got only three more minutes to the ID checkpoint. Alright, in three minutes we're jumping off this train. Got it? Cloud, come over here. Let's look at the railway map monitor. Well, I mean, we already seen it with Jesse. 
Huh, it looks like you've seen it already. It's alright, come a little closer. She wants closer, Cloud, do it! Spank that ass! Ah, uh, that's odd. The ID checkpoint was supposed to be further down. Taipei security alert. Unidentified passengers confirmed a search of all cars will be conducted. Taipei security alert. Unidentified passengers confirmed a search of all cars will be conducted. What's happening? What's going on? We're in trouble. I'll explain later. Hurry, get to the next car. Ah, damn it. Fuck, someone blew it. I'm going to for an unidentified passengers located in car number one preparing for lockdown. Let's go. Keep it up. Uh, they also showed a little bit of this part off in the trailer yesterday. And robots actually started coming through the train windows and everything. It looked fucking awesome. Car number one lockdown. Upgrading to level two warning. Hurry. They're locking the car door. The doors, sir. Run! Come on, let's go. Thank you. Car 2 locked down. Upgrading to warning level 3. Alright, we're clear. Not yet. They're starting another check. If we're caught, we're done for. But don't worry. If we move up the train car by car, we should get past it. Oh, let, let me move, Bert. Unidentified passengers moving to the front of the car. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. So somebody knocked some dude out. Jesus. C c move, bitch! <laughs> Upgrading to maximum security alert. Team up, move! Move, woman! Alright, we made it. Go this way. Thank you. Let's go. We're gonna dive out of here. It's me, Jesse. How do I look, Cloud? Not now. Let's concentrate on our plan. You're right, sorry. Right, come on. Move. Edge. No. <laughs> Too late for that now. Why do you come along anyway? Because. Hey, you too. There ain't no time for that. Yeah, I've made up my mind. Watch closely. I'm gonna jump. Thank you. You don't care if I go first. The leader always stays till the end. Yeah, yeah just shut the fuck up and let's get off the goddamn train! Bam, bam. All right, come on. No more talking. Let's go so we can kick ass. And blow up another reactor. God damn it. Good. So far, everything's going as planned. Oh, that was planned? Don't let your guard down till we get to the Sector 5 reactor. Big's Wedge of Jesse got everything ready for us, so move it. Cut all their asses! Fuck you, bug! Oh, come on, Tifa. So is shit! Weak as balls! Oh, that's not good. They slowed us down. But a dead bug is a good bug, and they're all good bugs. Let me tell you that much. No, oh, we gotta go through the little hole here. Barrett's gonna get scared. There's one damn tiny hole. Are you telling me to squeeze into that to get under the plate? No way. Let's go down. But damn, man, that thing gives me the chills. Where do they go when they go on the cloud? 
And it's kind of spacious in here, damn it. Okay. We're almost at the next reactor, people. We're gonna blow more shit up. Oh, this part was always confusing. On second thought, I should have probably gave her the... Well, I can't give her, but... Cloud could have probably used that lightning materia with the awe, which probably would have made things a lot better. But either way, a will punch a flying puffer fish in the face. That's what we'll do. Should have bought another lightning materia as well. Mistakes were made. It's all good though. <coughs> Damn. Antifa, you don't have the magic we need. Fire! Sorry, Coda, I stole your line. <laughs> uh, I think I have to go over towards him for sure. Hey, yo! Cloud, this way, the reactor's up this ladder. Cool. Let's go blow shit up. They get done with the second reactor mission. Hey. I'm sorry. The ID scan problem on the train was all my fault. I modified your ID card, and that's what did it. I did my best, but I failed. Yeah, you did. Stop failing. Be good! Go, Cloud, go, go, damn. Oh, god damn it. That's where that takes us. <laughs> to Jesse. Where'd you go? Why are we fighting in vents? It's so weird. Attack from both sides. Oh no. Whatever shall we do? Now we're gonna have to slow cut your asses. Why are you crying? Who did what? Who whose ass do I have to kick? Ah, monster. Thank you. Bye, please. Boo, why are you crying? I just got like on. Final Fantasy VII is best game ever. Now to the bombing. Probably going to kill innocent people. Hey Wolf, what is up? Hey uh, Cynical Gaming and Libby, how is your how is the stream going? Pretty good. So far. Playing my favorite game on my birthday, which is amazing. And we're going for the uh, the second reactor now. We're actually just about there. Got groovy to butt slap to oops, I did it again and clipped his ass. Clipped his face. <laughs> nice. Poor, poor groovy. So how'd you get him to do that, boo? 
Oh, and uh, away we go. I like how they put slides in reactors. It's really nice. <coughs> oh, this is where another lightning material would have came in. Nothing much. Gotta go to work in a bit, so wanted to stop by and tune in for a bit. Well, I, it's much appreciated. I'm glad you. I'm glad we could have you here. My internet is pretty bad though, so I didn't hear you, Boo. I said, how did you uh, get Groovy to do that? Hope I did not lose the come and go? What's that? Deadly waste? Oh no. Uh, let's go plant the bomb. Well, hopefully you didn't lose anything. Losing stuff sucks. Let me tell you. Sent 60 bits, which set the whole chat in a chant. Ha! Ah! That's fucking great. You need to send me that clip. If you can, please. Because I need to see this. Missed streams two days, but couldn't help. I was catching up on E3. Oh, um, this is my first stream in like almost a week because I haven't, um, I haven't been really feeling well and I've been wanting to uh, check up on E3 as well. So uh, I know, I know what you mean. <laughs> that face though, I gotta check out that clip. We will do that after after our stream has ended, though. First day, I'm sure. Blah. Plus, peeps due to inactivity. I know it just comes with the territory, but I know it. It sucks. I actually lost a follower as well, and uh, it sucks seeing the number go down that you worked up so hard for. So I know I know how you're feeling, uh, but hopefully you'll uh, you'll gain a whole bunch more. Cause your stream was pretty fun when we caught it the other day. You're actually very informative. Then the bombing after cloud goes crazy. Oh no. Teeth is dead, eh? Papa. Sephiroth. Did Sephiroth do this to you? Well, that's his big ass sword there. Sephiroth, soldier, Mako reactor, Shinra. I hate them all. Oh no. Teeth it out. He gonna fuck your shit. Damn man, get a hold of yourself. You all right? Tifa. Hmm. No. Forget. Come on, let's hurry. Yeah, at, 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 at. <laughs> Thank you. But definitely, you you'll definitely find more followers, Wolf. There. <laughs> For sure. Let's do this again so we don't have to go through crazy uh, clouds, crazy fucking thing. Just in case we die. Which is quite a possibility. Yeah, I co streamed the Xbox briefing 
and really wanted to see Square Enix and Bethesda. The others, I'm going to tune in at work. Um, out of the ones that you've seen, who do you think did the best? In my opinion, I've, I've seen them all so far. But in my, my opinion, I honestly think uh, Square Enix took the show. Man, Square Enix went all out excited for so many games. Yeah, it's so, so am I. Like, I mean, we got a nice, I think it was like over 20 minutes of the remake. And then they ended things off with the new uh, Avengers game, which is kind of like Anthem. And Square Enix is making it, so it's not going to suck like Anthem, which is nice. <laughs> Baby, you have to check that out, the trailer for that. It actually looks really good. That could be another game that we could get into, uh, Libby. As long as I'm Iron Man, because, well, Iron Man's awesome. But yeah, we're getting a remaster of Final Fantasy VIII. And just so many other good Square Enix games. Square Enix hands down, they held nothing back. I have three pages of games I'm excited about. Hell yeah. Out of uh out of everything you've seen, what is the game that you're most excited about? I'll give you uh two hints at the one I'm most excited about. It also might happen to have something to do with the game I'm playing right now. Maybe. <laughs> Which game? I'll look it up. Yeah, the, uh, the new Avengers game by Square Enix. It's uh, an Anthem type game. It comes out uh, early next year. It's, uh, it's made by the same people who are doing Final Fantasy. So, uh, yeah, it's gonna be good, other than Anthem. Some I have questions by, though, on some of Xbox, Bethesda, and Square Enix. Um, I, I could safely say that I haven't been excited about any any of the Xbox or Bethesda games. Um, I know Nintendo showed off uh, Breath of the Wild 2. They showed a teaser trailer for that. I'm excited for that. That's uh, going to be pretty cool. And then um, there was uh, their Animal Crossing, which sounds really good. I hope I'm not spoiling anything for you, by the way. I'm gonna fling this internet out the window. It buffs every time you answer me. <clears throat> I'm sorry, baby. It's uh, the Avengers from Square Enix. Oh, this part usually takes me a couple tries. Damn it! That was way too soon. There we go! So for Xbox, I want to see more gameplay on Crossfire X, because it looks... You see, that's what the sad thing was, like, Microsoft toted that they have all these games and everything, but all they showed off was, like, cinematic trailers, and it... I don't know, it, it didn't look good to me. Um... I'm gonna use ethers on them. I could have just used the goddamn tent I have. I forgot all about that. But, uh... And Bethesda was like the same way. Bethesda didn't really show off nothing that anybody wanted to see. And then there was a lot of mobile stuff at E3, which... is just horrible. I, I don't want to play this game with you guys. Fine, we will. Kick your asses. 
Bethesda had Doom. That was it. Like, Bethesda doesn't win because of Doom. I have to, I do say, like, they didn't show nothing new. We knew Doom was coming out. We all knew that. We can, we've already seen Doom so many different times. What else did Bethesda show? Do Doom! That's it! That is like the best thing Bethesda showed! Like Bethesda had nothing ready. What they they said they're gonna finally fix um, Fallout 76. The, the game's been out for so long now that they're finally gonna fix it. it. It's like if EA came out and said, oh, we're finally gonna fix Anthem. No one fucking cares! <laughs> but new Nintendo is the victory this year, in my opinion. But not nah, Nintendo. Like, Nintendo didn't show off enough for me to say that. I mean, Square Square Enix showed off a hell of a lot. You had Final Fantasy VII, yeah. You know that's a big one for me. But we had Dragon Quest Builders 2. We had the remaster of Final Fantasy VIII, which, honestly, I'm excited to add to my collection. Uh, yeah, Breath of the Wild sequel. They didn't show shit off except for a, a spooky-ass basement from the castle. That's it. And Banjo in Smash Brothers... Okay, it's a new character. That's it. Like, it, there's nothing special about it. It's just a, you know, Xbox cross Nintendo thing. So. I mean, they showed Nintendo really didn't have much. But then again, that's how Nintendo works. They showed off, um, what, two new Resident Evil games that are coming to the Switch, which are more ports. That That's it. Like, and they showed off, uh, what, Animal Crossing. Okay. Shinra Soldiers. When he end, it's opinions. LOL. I'm glad Enix got you hyped, man. Yo, Enix had so much cool shit. And they stealth dropped the game on Switch. Like, that, that I think, was awesome. What the hell's going on? A trap! It's a trap! But, yeah, dude, Square Enix, uh... <laughs> Square Enix tickles my fancy. This year, I think they had the best showing. Honestly. But then again, you're right, it's all opinion-based. And my opinion is, I want RPGs forever. And Square Enix was like, we got you, buddy. I did not get into Doom at all, so not excited at all. So two more I wanted more info on was Eden Ring and The Outer World. The Outer World looks cool. I, I'll give you that. And Eden Ring looks like it could be something cool. The Outer World, I saw the trailer, but I wanted some actual gameplay, not just trailers. That That's what, that's what E3 was. It was like trailer after trailer after trailer. Square Enix actually actually showed a hell of a lot of gameplay, which I was happy with. Nintendo did too. Outriders, the Enix showed off looks interesting. Made by the same people who made Painkiller, which I love. Yeah. Pre president Shinra. Why is the president here? Hmm, so you all must be... what was it? Avalanche, and don't you forget it! So you're President Shinra, huh? Bethesda, I have a question mark by... Ghostwire Tokyo looked intriguing, but want more info on it. And that was the thing, like... This E3... Um, other than Square Enix... And I, I'm, I'm gonna give it to Nintendo. Nintendo was like my second pick this year. But this E3 felt like a, uh, oh, what the hell is the word? It felt like a past year because all the new uh, consoles are going to be coming out next year. 
and everything, so nobody really had much to show. Granted, you know, the King Dick Xbox came out on stage was like, we're gonna show 60 games. They didn't show shit. They showed trailers to something that nobody's gonna want. And a lot of those games weren't exclusive. So, I mean, none of those games are exclusive if we're talking about Xbox, as we play it all on PC. U Ubisoft was horrible. <laughs> Has that one game that seems super interesting, Breath of the Wild type open world game, but Greek mythology, demons and monsters. That one looked alright, I guess. Ghostwire Tokyo has me super interested. Action survival horror game. The one game I think it was showed off at Xbox was, uh, was it like 15 minutes or 15 hours or some shit? It was basically, uh, like a thriller type story about a guy trapped in a time loop. I thought that looked kind of interesting. Long time no see, sir. Yeah. Long time no see. Oh, you. You're the one who quit Soldier and joined Avalanche. I knew you'd be... I knew you'd been exposed to Mako from the look in your eyes. Oh, fuck Keanu Lee Reeves. Xbox didn't have Keanu Reeves. The fucking game has Keanu Reeves. He just happened to be on the Xbox stage because Sony didn't show up. <laughs> Tell me, traitor, what was your name? Cloud. And honestly, it was probably the best thing for Sony not to show up anyway. Because Sony doesn't have much to show right now. And honestly, the Xbox, with the Xbox, they, they let out the uh, specs on the Xbox One Scarlet or Xbox Scarlet or whatever. It was copy and paste PlayStation 5. Like, both systems are going to be exactly the same. Sony and Microsoft should just come together, make one fucking console. Honestly. I would love that, not gonna lie. <laughs> Top ones, I am pre-ordering the second Ori Will of the Wisps. That looked nice. I, I'm gonna say that. That looked impressive. Gears 4, Final Fantasy 7 Remake, First Class Edition. Hell yeah! But most I want don't come out till 2020. I'm so excited for Ori, I love the first one. You really did love the first one, Tim. I don't do horror games, you could ask Tim that. I don't have enough money for diapers. Y'all could keep them. Give me for asking, but I can't be expected to remember everyone's name. Unless you become another Sephiroth. Haha, <laughs> Sephiroth. He was brilliant. Perhaps too brilliant. So Doom Eternal is probably the most expensive collector's edition I've ever paid for. $217. Damn, dude. So to that I did not hear a ton about, which was last E3... There was no The Last of Us Part 2. I want to play that. That, I think Sony is going to announce in one of their, like, Nintendo Direct-esque, um, PlayStation shows. I mean, Sony didn't even show up to E3 this year. That's why we didn't hear about that. Don't give a damn about none of that. This place is going up with a big bang soon. Serves y'all right. Uh, probably gonna be 2020. Yeah, The Last of Us probably be 2020. Um, I, you know what? I could see it still coming out by this holiday. That's how much it is? $324 for the first class edition? No way! You know what? Worth it. I don't give a damn. I honestly pegged that to be $250. Not $320. Jesus Christ. Yo, if I had the money, I would throw it at them. I just, honestly, I would. Vermin. That's all you could say? Vermin? Shinra, the vermin, for killing the planet. I guess that'd make you king, vermin, so shut up, jackass. 
Thanks for the host, Tim. Awesome. You were beginning to bore me. I'm a very busy man, so if you'll excuse me, I have a dinner I must attend. Most expensive. The other no info was... Nothing on Skyrim 6, Elder Scrolls. Yep, for reals, the, the price. I remember that guy after the FF7 gameplay thing. Take my wallet! Yeah, dude, that's me. It's just... My wallet's my phone, so I'm not gonna throw it, but... You know... Here, we'll, we'll just... You know, huh, take it. Print, yeah. Here, here, here you, you, you want these two, too? Take it. <laughs> that, that's how much it is. If I had it, I would. <laughs> oh, God. $324. Jesus Christ. Now I don't know where my card's at. Uh, yeah, there they go. Can't lose them. Dinner, don't give me that. I ain't even started with you yet. The question mark by Deathloop. I was curious. I didn't see that, or I don't even remember it. I also just noticed you're on a team. Nice job, man. I'm on a team? Who's on a team? What's this team thing about? Alert Force? Oh, yeah, I guess. I don't know what it is. <laughs> it was just something that was like, hey, do you want to join? Sure, I guess. But I've made arrangements for a playmate for you all. Mostly all I saw was indie, mobile, and trailers. Not much game. There wasn't a lot of gameplay at all this either. What's that noise? It's the Airbuster! The hell is that? It's the Airbuster, damn it. Meet Airbuster, a techno soldier. Our weapon development department created him. I'm sure the data he'll extract from your dead bodies will be of great use to us in the future experiments. Ow! Oh, that's nifty. I gotta check that out. Techno soldier. Now then, if you'll excuse me. Wait, President. Yo, Cloud, we've got to do something about him. Also, Deathloop looks really interesting. The game where whatever, the guy gets killed by the girl. He wakes up again. Same with the girl. Octopath Traveler, I can play now. It's on Steam. I need to invest in that. Because I've wanted to play Octopath Traveler for a while. Help, Cloud. This is from Soldier. No way, it's just a machine. I don't care what it is, I'm gonna bust him up. Damn right, we gotta bust his ass up. Boss battle number two, guys. Let's see if we can do it. Of course we can. Come on now. Antifa, you are our healer. Make sure we stay alive. Also, when you get your, um, limit breaks, you, we're gonna need you to bust some faces, please. I don't have a Nintendo Switch, and I wanted to play that as soon as I came, as soon as it came out. But damn, Nintendo! So you think the entire first part will be in Midgar, or you think it'll be longer than that? Um, as we kick this thing's ass, I'll explain that, on my theories anyway. Um, the entire first part is going to be Midgar. It, it's going to, but I honestly think what it's going to be is we're going to get the calm, and after Cloud's uh, flashback, I think that's where it's going to end. After the after the um, the Shinra escape sequence, I think that's where that's going to end. I've been playing this all wrong. Holy shit! I usually don't do this bad. Perfect. 
Yo, bitch! <laughs> Tifa looks OP as hell. Yeah, she does. Yo, T. Oh, Cloud's dead! No! I never have anybody die in this battle. I am not concentrating whatsoever. This is not good. I did love the cinematic look of Combat and 7 Remake, though. It looks badass. Yeah, I really like that it's. It's a mix of both the old school and new school um, battle systems. I think it looks really, I think it's done really well. Um, you know, you, you gotta use square to uh, attack, but once your ATB bar fills up, you could either do it one of two ways. You could set uh, shortcuts up for your actions, or you can, um, you could go ahead and have time stop. Which I think that is really cool as hell. I was really worried about the, uh, the battle system in 7 Remake. Now, I am fucking fine with it. I think they did it the best possible way to move it up into, um, a more modern, uh, way. Did we wait? Yeah, we did. We kicked its ass! Another one that much was not announced a bunch on was Halo Infinite. All they stated was Holiday 2020. I don't think they could really, I don't think they really have to say anything about a Halo game. We all know what a Halo game is going to be. Okay. The, the best thing that they did with the Halo, um, whatever, the Halo Infinite. The best thing they did was announce it for the Xbox Scarlet. They said it's going to be a launch game for that. So, best move on Microsoft's part is having a new Xbox console launch with a new Halo. So, I, I honestly think that was fucking awesome. Okay, the music stopped abruptly, but it had me, uh, it had me kind of scared that my game may have messed up. It's gonna blow! Let's go, Tifa! Barrett, can't you do something? Not a damn thing. He's just trying to save his money. That's why I don't want to save Cloud. Cloud, please don't die. You can't die. There's still so much I want to tell you. I know, Tifa. Hey, you gonna be alright? Be strong. You worry about yourselves. I'll be alright. But take care of Tifa. Blair Witch got my interest as a horror fan as well. Worst part is finding a spot for the Scarlet. Ah, just trade in your Xbox One, dude. You're going to be able to play everything you own on that on the uh, Scarlet. And let the Scarlet take the Xbox One, please. As far as Blair Witch goes, I have no interest in that. That game came out of left field out of nowhere. Who's excited for the, Scar uh, the, the Blair Witch? I thought for sure Blair Witch was going to be another shitty Outlast. I th you know what? I thought it was an Outlast game too. I'm still not sure though. I hope it's not another run from the monster game. We'll discuss more tomorrow if I see you. Got 10 minutes before I gotta get to work. Are uh, you have a good night at work or day at work. <laughs> so uh, hopefully uh, you know your, your work doesn't stress you so much. Stop talking like this is the end. Okay, hold on. And Cloud Falls. And we meet the Flower Girl again now. But the the Blair Witch uh, game, it kind of looks like one of those games where... Like Dead by Daylight. It kind of gave me that feel too. Where you have to try to escape the ghost or whatever. So, I don't know. Are you alright? Can you hear me? Yeah. Back then, I only got scraped knees. Oh shit. Final Fantasy 7. What is up, Trav? How you doing, man? What do you mean by back then? What about now? Can you get up? 
What do you mean by back then? What about now? Don't worry about me. Worry about yourself now. I'll try. Oh, it moved! Uh, how about that? Take it slow now, little by little. Hello, hello? I know. Yeah, man. I had I had to play seven for my birthday stream, dude. Uh, great and always better. Awesome, dude. But yeah, I know my birthday was yesterday, but I didn't stream then, so I'm taking full advantage of that now. And I thought to uh, why not play my favorite game of all time? By the way, by the way, sorry I've been absent lately. My mom's been suffering from pneumonia. Oh damn, dude! I hope she's uh, I hope she's gonna be all right. Hey, who are you? Hello, hello. It's Aerith. Hold on, what's six? You okay? Tried to take on the sawmill horde in Days Gone today. It didn't go well. Yeah, dude, I was, uh... I was, um, watching that. I was, uh, lurking you when I seen you going through that. It did not look fun at all. She's slowly getting better, but she's been out of it the past week or so. So I've been running the uh, house lately. Hey man, at least she got you there to help, you know? This is a church in Sector 5 slums. You just fell from above. You really gave me a scare. I came crashing down. The roof and the flower bed must have broken your fall. You're lucky it didn't break your fucking back! <laughs> Jesus. Flower bed, is this yours? Sorry about that. It's alright. The flowers here are quite resilient because this is a sacred place. They say grass and flowers won't grow in Midgar. But for some reason, they have no trouble blooming here. 500 freakers in one place. Wasted so much ammo and time. I bet you did, man. Yeah, she's been telling me how thankful she is. But I'll have more time to catch a stream soon. Been meaning to support more people when I can. Oh, man, take your time, dude. Just make sure your bomb's all right. I love it here. Cloud isn't sorry. He secretly hates flowers. Right? That's why he landed on him. Son of a bitch. Um... This part always confused me, because you have to do some stupid shit. I'll give you a little more time. Hey, bitch! So we meet again. Trav, have you seen the trailer that came out for this yesterday? And the one the day before? Family first, bro. Nobody will or should judge. Hell no, dude! Yo, know, help your mom out, your dad, or whatnot. And by the way, did you see Alpha Omega Sin posted a video after the seven video? Yeah, I did. He finally back on um on YouTube. Yeah, I remember. You were selling flowers. Oh, I'm so happy. Thanks for buying my flowers. Say, you don't have any materia. Yes, yeah, some. Salivator oil. Okay, let me ask you, Trav. The uh, the part that they showed off when Cloud first met Aerith when she was in Midgar selling the flowers. And she freaked the fuck out, dropped her basket, and said, Help me, and grabbed Cloud. What do you think were the phantoms that were flying around her? Because I have my own theory on it, but I want to see if anybody else thinks differently. Thanks, man. You too, Jay. I've pretty much been attached to her since this started. I don't blame you, man. It's your mom. 
You know, you gotta help your ma out when you can. Nowadays, you can find materia anywhere. But mine is special. It's good for absolutely nothing. No, it's not. Woman, it's gonna save the world. Good for nothing. You just don't know how to use it. No, I do. It just doesn't do anything. Couldn't say, been thinking about it myself. Okay, here's my theory on it. Let me take a swig of this and then I'll tell you. My theory on that is... It's pretty much the soul of the ancients. She just doesn't know what it is quite yet. You know how she's the... She has... You know, she's pretty much the last bloodline of the ancients. And she has all that ability and whatnot floating around in her. I honestly think, that, think that's what she sees when she sees and talks to the planet. And... She just wasn't used to it. My favorite Nakey Jakey quote when talking about saves. When you finally find that save after a boss fight, like, oh, my materia was getting nervous. <laughs> I feel safe just having it. It was my mother's. Right? It does make sense, doesn't it? At least I hope that's what it is. I know, um... Another viewer earlier said it was like, uh, Magic Turks, you know, or, or Ghostly Turk Ninjas. <laughs> but I don't think that's what it was. Say, I feel like talking. Do you feel up to it? After all, here we are meeting again. <coughs> I don't mind, woman. Wait here, I've got to check my flowers. It'll be a minute. Phantoms of the Final Fantasy movie in 7 confirmed. <laughs> maybe. 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 Hopefully it's not the same Phantoms that was in the Final Fantasy movie. Because those that movie was just trash. Just a little longer. Oh. Now that you mention it. We don't know each other's names, do we? My name is... No, it is not! God damn it! Give me a minute. I always forget how to spell it. Alright. Eh, eh. Eh, eh. There we go. That's your fucking name. I'm Aerith, the flower girl. Nice to meet you. People might get pissed at me changing that, but that's her goddamn name! The name's Cloud. Me? I do a little bit of everything. Oh, Jack of all trades. Yeah, I do whatever's needed. What's so funny? Why are you laughing at? Sorry, I just... Christine. No! It's Aerith, not Eris. Cloud, don't let it get to you. Uh, hoya! Don't mind me, don't mind me. Eh. Say, Cloud, have you ever been a bodyguard? You can do anything, right? I find that funny. Everyone calls her Aerith, yet isn't it chronologically Eris? No! Chronologically, it's Aerith. Eris was a mistranslation from the Japanese uh, script to English. But everybody calls her Eris. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Then get me out of here. Take me home. Okay, but it'll cost you. Okay, then let's see. I'll be your slut for a night. I mean, how about a date? <laughs> I don't... Know who you are, but you don't know me. Interesting. I never really knew that, but I guess translation wasn't as good back then. No, it wasn't, dude. Translation was horrible back then. This game has so many messed up um, lines because of translation that I'm kind of hoping they leave the this guy are sick line in the remake because I think it'd be fucking hilarious. 
I know you. Oh yeah, I know you. Butthead voice. Whoa, sluts. <laughs> a uniform. Hey sis, this one's a little weird. Shut up, Shinra spy. You know, I want him taken out. I haven't decided yet. Don't fight here. You'll ruin the flowers. Ugh. I always hated this part. But I wonder how they're gonna do it in the remake. The exit is back there. We have to go through a big ass hole in the roof. Like the one you came through. They were Mako eyes. Oh, the Barretts? Yeah, alright. Come on, get to work. Oh. And don't step on the flowers. You just stepped on them yourself. They're rude. They're gonna get you. Holy hell. Eh. And up. Oh. There they are. Over there. I'm gonna screw this part up because I never remember what barrels to push. Cloud, that one. I know, looks like they aren't going to let us go. What should we do? Oh, we can't let them catch us, can we? There's only one thing left to do. I'm debating what console I should get the 8 remaster for. You damn well know your Nintendo trash ass is going to get it on the Switch. Aerith, this way. Stop fronting, man. You know you're doing it. Alright, I'll hold them off. Right, make sure they don't get through. The agent is getting away. Attack, attack, attack. Yeah, you're gonna just shoot their shit out of her? I think we killed them? They never should have fought us. LOL, probably, but we'll see. You no, we'll see. You damn well know you're getting it on the switch. <laughs> I feel in my jubblies. Cloud, help! Damn. What's that? Earth, hold on a minute. Uh, I want to say this one. And are you? Oh god, I almost crashed her. Oh, Cloud, what are you doing? Fuck, I don't have her set up. Shit. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to hopefully get lucky on this one. They're not taking shit out of her. Oh yeah, we really need to speed this up. Thank you. <laughs> Three attacks. Three damn attacks. I'm really glad we could speed this shit up. Ah! Cloud help! Hold on a minute. Uh oh god damn it. You slow bastards! Die! Thank you! <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, come on. Be the right barrel. Be the right one. Be the right one. Yes! Thanks, Cloud. Alright, bitch. Come on. Cloud, help! Hold on a minute. Aha, bitch! <laughs> Thanks, Cloud. Oh, you couldn't jump that before, could you? Alright, let's slow this down. Gonna stream Legends of Lagaya one of these days. Dude, that was a pretty good game back in the day. One game I would love to stream, I'd have to uh, hook my PS3 up for it because I got the PlayStation 1 Classic, is Xenogears. But, oh my god, does that... That game is like an 18-book series. There is more reading in that game than all the Tolkien books combined. <laughs> They're looking for me again. You mean it's not the first time they've been after you? No. They're the Turks. Hmm? 
The Turks are a Shinra organization. They scout for possible candidates for soldier. But Xeno, yeah, Xenogears was a really good game back in the day. This violently, I thought they were kidnapping someone. They're also involved in a lot of other dirty stuff on the side. Spying, murder, you know. They look like it. But why are they after you? There must be a reason, right? No, not really. I think they believe I have what it takes to be a soldier. Maybe you do. You want to join them? Legend of Lugai is one of my all-time favorite RPGs. I'd play that dead if I could. <laughs> do it up, man. That's why I'm playing this. If, if I had to pick only one game to play for the rest of my life, this would be it. I don't know, but I don't want to get caught by those people. Then let's go. Let's go, Aerith. Which is her correct name, people. I'm also so damn excited for the Sinking City. Amazing looking horror game with a lot of Lovecraftian influences. I didn't see that one. Star Ocean was alright. Um... Depending on the Star Ocean. I think I played Star Ocean... Three? Wait, wait, I said... Star Ocean 3 was pretty cool. The one where they were stuck in a video game. Or a computer or whatever. That one I thought was pretty cool. Puff, wheeze. Slow down, don't leave me. Star Ocean 2. Funny, I thought you were cut out to be a soldier. Oh, you're terrible. <laughs> hey, Cloud, were you ever a soldier? I used to be. How did you guess? <laughs> Your eyes. They have a strange glow. That's the sign of those who have been infused with Mako. A mark of soldier. But how did you know about that? Oh, nothing. Nothing? Alright, nothing. Come on, let's go, bodyguard. The soul of my boyfriend's in you. Kinda. <laughs> Star, I haven't played any Star Ocean except for that one. It was like Star Ocean the last something or another. I forgot. I, it's been so long since I played it. I played that back on the uh, PlayStation 2, I believe. Phew, finally made it off. Now what? Um, My house is over here. I hurry before they come. All right, let's go, woman. And we're gonna save. Boop doop. Boop doop. Boop doop doop doop. Let me see. Burp, burp, burp. Okay, let's go to our house. Oh, here it is. Here it is. This guy is sick. Oh, they fixed it! They fixed the translation! Why? By the way, Jay, you should look into a game sometime called Small Saga. What's that about? But th they fixed the translation, man! It was supposed to be this guy are sick. Damn it. You passed out nearby and someone must have helped him here. Small, small saga, small saga. I don't remember ever hearing about that. This is the one. Won't you help him? Well, listen, I'm a doctor. No, I guess not. Hey, that man has a tattoo. I think it's a number two. Sephiroth clone. Bloop. Actually, before I do that, let's go over here. Pick up the items in her garden. Sit in ether. 
It's about rats trying to get food from a heaven type place, general store, that the gods humans own. It's rats, but in a normal world, and it's super charming. Turn based RPG. If it's a turn based RPG, I'll check it out. I love turn based RPGs. Uh, what's, what's it on? Best game ever, though. Goat Simulator. No, it's not. PC Simulator. Best game ever. But anyway, guys, we're gonna call it quits on the stream here. We at that two-hour mark. I wasn't planning on a long stream. I do plan on streaming this a lot longer over the weekend. Uh, because, well, it's Final Fantasy VII, and it's fucking amazing. But, it's on PC. Uh... It'll be on Kickstarter here in a few days. Awesome. But yeah, guys, uh, thanks to everybody who actually showed up, and thanks for all the birthday wishes and all that nifty jazz. You guys are awesome. So, uh, yeah, I will check you guys out in the next one. But before we go, we definitely got to host somebody. So who are we hosting, guys? Not hosting, but rating. Let's see. There we go. We got Queen of Extreme on. We got Ray Ray. You know what? You know what? You know what? You know what? She's not part of Defiance, but she's fucking awesome. We're gonna raid Ray Ray. I'm gonna need you to guys to go over and say hi to Ray Ray because Ray Ray is an awesome streamer. And she plays a lot of uh, RPGs and Apex Legends as well. So, uh, go show her some love, guys. Go follow and all that nifty jazz. But, uh, we're definitely gonna go ahead and call it quits on this stream. And again, thank you all for, uh, for stopping by. But we're raiding now, so give her my love.